case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1890, the Supreme Court of Missouri heard the case of Lingenfelder v. Wainwright Brewing Company. The issue centered on whether a promise to pay extra for work already obligated under a contract is legally binding. The dispute arose between Wainwright Brewing Company and Edmund Jungenfeld's executors. Jungenfeld was entitled to a commission on the cost of a refrigerating plant for his work as the designer and supervisor of certain brewery buildings. Jungenfeld had been promised a bonus if he completed the original contract under its original terms. The court determined that his existing contract already covered designing and supervising the construction, and the new promise did not require him to do anything more or different. Thus, Jungenfeld could not receive the commission. The plaintiffs contested various aspects of the referee's report, but the circuit court overruled all except the tenth. The Supreme Court of Missouri disagreed with the circuit court's judgment regarding the tenth exception and ultimately reversed that judgment. The Supreme Court ruled that Wainwright Brewing Company could recover $1,492.17 with interest from the plaintiffs as executors of Edmund Jungenfeld. The court reasoned that the promise to pay extra did not create a defense for the remainder of the existing contract, and changes in building plans did not entitle parties to additional compensation. This decision emphasized the principle that demanding more money for work already obligated under a contract is unfair and not legally enforceable. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class. 